Welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. Are you ready to go place some pearls and pick up treasure and maybe visit a gallery? No? Well, that's what I gotta be doing. So let's have a look see. I can't remember how the map works in this game, honestly, so... I don't know, I don't really want to explore too much of the sea. Simply because doing so, there are some dangerous spots that I want to like. I don't know. Maybe actually, let's go up here and then head down this way. Go down there for the saving, come back up here, get that, and then get this one last. Or we could. Uh, yeah, we'll do that. And then once we get that one. Can also like go back here. We'll have enough rubies surely by that point. So that we need to head north two spots up to the Isle of Steel. Isle of Steel. Let us make sail! Gonna take a while. At least the normal scene music's playing. Instead of just being all like. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Although we will do that regardless when we run into enemies along the sea. There's so many islands to visit. I want to save that kind of exploration for later on. Although, to get to here and over here, we're gonna see three different locations, one of which we have to go to. I just, I think this one might be the one that I'm dreading the most, and it's gonna be the one we're going to first. You know, how does this work? The thing he's holding, like, does he do something with the dead sharky? Sharky, shark. Oh, right. Sharky, too. Return of the shark. But you sharks are nothing to put. Oh my god, look at that. But those shots are nothing compared to the horrors of the seas that we can face. A 50. Whoa! Jump the shark and hit the shark! Son of a bitch, that's the first. God, we're surrounded. Probably like, oh, we're getting the hell out of here. Now we can see it. In the daytime, it's very grey. What was that? That must be. No, I think that is the Isle. Isle of Warren Avenue. No, is that it? Far where there. It kind of looks like a lighthouse a bit, doesn't it? Oh, we just went from a stormy endless night. Now we're back to storms. So soon. Okay, we're on that side now. So. We go. 
sun comes back out. One island I'm thinking of kind of reminds me of this silhouette. So I don't think it is the one I'm thinking of. Maybe. But maybe it is. If it is, it's the one that I mistook for a few parts ago. It wasn't. It does look a bit like it. There's this one uh, island that's uh, you can actually have your own private cabana, essentially. But I wouldn't say how we get that just yet. It will be quite a while before we get to that. Fishy, fish, 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 fish. Tell me, what land island is this? Hi, oh, small fry! Yeah, yeah, I've heard. I think you'll want to charge the information about this island. Let's stop out this stupid shit chart. Stonewater Island. So oh, tell me, small fry, have you heard about the Golden Triumph Fox? There are such things. And there's a chart that'll show you where to find them on that island there. If you want it, try asking that huge, crutchy looking stone watcher. I doubt you could even budge the thing. Though, you've got skinny arms, fry. And that's all the info I got off. If you want to hear it again, you'll have to throw some more bay on the water for me. Sorry about that, my boss, fry. Can't go find even on empty stomach, you know. And with that, I'm off. Kinda of curious to check it out, but yeah, why not? It's not directly in the opposite direction. I don't think we can do anything about it the way you described it. We need something that we currently don't have. But... I mean, is that that guy with the telescope again? It is, isn't it? He's everywhere, man. Crabs. Which direction are you looking off to? Oh god, this direction we're going to. That can't be good. Oh my, that battery of mounted guns is a dangerous thing if only someone could blow the entire lot of them to bits. It is such a shame that they exist for there is something wonderful hidden there. Yeah, it can't lift that. Okay, what? Hey! With the power you have now, you can either lift or destroy that stone. And yet somewhere on this sea, the power to do so lies waiting for one to find it. You must seek it out. Yeah, we can't do anything about it right now. Where to park my boots? Let's go into the danger zone. I wonder what's up there. I hear... I hear them. They're aiming at whatever they're aiming at. Maybe it's even up here. That the cannons are. Yeah, those look like cannons. But they're the ones that are firing. What's up, guys? You gonna hit me with a telescope? I guess he is. Oh, 
my pendants. A recipe. Loot for everything we can, really. The cannons were coming from here or somewhere else. So treasure appearing on the sea there. But it's in the opposite direction. No, it's actually the fish. It might have been treasure there as well. So we're heading this way. I wonder if we can somehow use the telescope to actually see what's over there. Nope. In the cannon from that, then I guess. I guess they're on auto. Because who the hell's controlling them now? Well, the sea seems awfully peaceful. Oh, it is. I don't want to go there. Mommy, please. <laughs> Actually, can I use a telescope on this? Can you see them? Those figures of death. You can even see them now slowly appearing in and out of focus. The terror of the high seas. You've seen sharks, you've seen fish, you've seen seagulls, but you've seen nothing quite like these. These things. The fish. The fish gives no fucks about these. But we, we really shouldn't. They're quite dangerous. And there are many. And the music's all cheery. How, uh, Unbidding. Well, we gotta get over there. <laughs> it would have been more fitting to approach them at night, really, wouldn't it? For added terror. Oh god, I'm dreading it so much. They're apparently scared of seagulls, though. Oh god, here it comes. This is why you don't fuck with these things. Hold it! I've got to feed my fish. You just wait a moment there, Mr. Sea Hat. Hi, oh, small fry. I see you pissed off a bunch of sea hats. Well, I don't give a fuck. Yeah, yeah, but I think you want to try any information about the time. It's not by opening up the sea trial. Don't worry, time's frozen, so they don't do anything. Southern Triangle Island. <laughs> a famed pictograph who lives far to the north of here on Midfall Island. He's apparently real wise and talented in the ways of pictography. He's even said to have legendary pictographs that he treasures above all other things. He keeps them hidden away in a secret safe, so they say. Or so they say. We can actually get them depending on what uh, part of the moon is visible in the sky on Windfall when we visit. It has some, it's to do with the Nintendo Gallery thing. By the way, small fry, what exactly is a picture box anyway? And what the fuck is that thing over there? And that's all the info I got off it. If you want to hear it again, you'll have to throw some more bait on the water for me. Sorry, but that's my body fry. I can't go find evil on my stomach, cause you'll be fighting the evil. Well, evil will kick your ass there, because look at that thing, you know? And with that, I'm off. And so are you as well. Oh! <laughs> I mean, how are we supposed to blow away? To the island! To the island! To safety! To safety! 
They can't get us on land. They can't. Ow. We can't do shit about them, really. Well, like I said, they're scared of uh, seagulls for whatever reason. Oh, my God. oh, I was wrong. They apparently do like to go on land. They just don't care. This is like something you expect, like someone finds a glitch in a game that looks horrifying. But this is legit. Oh wait, I hear it, I remember reading. The boomerang works on them. Fuck you guys! Aha! But that doesn't stop them. It just makes it so that they can swim. My god. I was kidding when I said these things are terrifying. I thought this was it's just like what people always say with Zelda whenever something like really scary in a Zelda game. It's like, I thought this was a game for kids. Just like, what is this? Like 12 and up or something like that? Good link is like, ah, oh, there it is. My boomerang went went on its own adventure. Yeah, well, I got a boomerang. Do you want the boomerang? Wandering traveler who seeks to guide first to the goddesses. Place the pearl you hold here. I take that fine pearl. Not used pearl to be example of pearl you got not too long ago, actually. Place an used pearl in the ancient statue's hands. Two pearls remain. Ah, yeah, nothing happens just yet until we put them all in. Whoa, 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 whoa. I do not want to be this close to such a thing. You motherfuckers! I think it's high time we finally actually use one of these pairs so I can show you exactly what they actually do. Summons a seagull! And look at these guys. They are terrified of this seagull. Like, oh no! It's gonna crap! It's gonna poop on my head! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> it wasn't as effective as you made it out to be, Internet. But it does kind of make them a bit more wary, I guess. Fuck you! Where's your propellers now? I don't... I, I think bombs can be... Waiting there, thank you. <laughs> see his face just like a... These guys, man. Did he grow him back? I think they've grown them back. They're regenerating. Let's get the fuck out of here. Ah. Wrong way. Oh, God! Do I even dare pick up treasure while these things are on my tail? I'm just that ballsy. Okay, they're giving up the chase, probably. Yep. Let's see what I mean, man. Those, those things, they're, they're terrifying. Red rupee. Still haven't got enough for the funny thing. Next island is God knows what, but we're heading for Forest Haven. You can see in the distance over there. Oh my god, there's seagulls over there. 
keep a bit away from the ass. Eagles indicate big octo of death. I think that's the cabana that I was talking about. Let's get some bait ready for the fish. The fishman. Yeah, this is the cabana. Small fry, yeah, yeah, I've heard. I think you want to try the information about the island. Well, then, stop by up and up to see you. Private Oasis, yeah, this is the island with the combine. So, tell me, small fry, have you heard of the golden set of Triumph Fox? We all talk about Triumph Fox here. It's right there, I tell you. What shot that shows you where they are in that house? If you want it, you better go in there and score the place from floor to ceiling. And that's all info I got off. If you want to hear it again, you'll have to throw some more bait on the water for me. Sorry, back my box try. Can't go find you more empty stomach, you know. And with that, I'm off. We can't actually get into there just yet, though. Hey, look, treasure over there. But we will be able to. We'll actually even own the cabana at some point. That one's a bit of a more difficult one. Yeah, I'm not surprised I didn't get that. Yeah. Ooh, got it. I think this one might actually be one of the ones with the treasure charts. Because that one seemed like it'd be impossible otherwise, and it was glowing more than the other ones. It was actually reflecting like it. Oh my god, a silver ruby, 200, that means we can afford the shit that we want. I would visit the island right now, but let's not waste too much time. Gotta go to, well we don't have to, but I'm going to the forest haven because I want to freaking get the Nintendo thing already, you know, with the gallery, so that we can start taking pictures. Of pretty much everything we see. And then later on, we will f be able to travel a bit more efficiently and probably come back here more often. It takes a while to approach the island, which is a giant tree. I think it's that small tree in the middle is where we gotta go. Look at that, they both look the same. They have that kind of nose and stuff. So the other one must have been the original Deku tree, maybe. I don't know. Then again, the Deku tree is inside the tree, so I don't understand, really. Oh no, that's the platform, isn't it, that you land on? I think it might be that one over there. I don't know. Or maybe it's that up there. Yeah, it's that up there. See that ladder? We gotta get it up there. The ladder will drop down once we've gone up there once, but we've got mail. Good evening, letters will link. We have one letter. Here's your letter. It's always wet. How are you doing, Link? Do you have enough of Granny's uh, soup? Where are you now? You may be closer than I suspect. Are you hungry? Are you keeping warm? You haven't injured yourself, have you? You always work so hard, Link. Do you have enough rubies? Your grandma doesn't have a lot, but I'm sending you everything I've saved up. As long as I have you and Harrell, I don't need anything else. I just want the two of you to return home safely. Of grandma. Ah, isn't that sweet of her? Twenty rubies. I'm not even gonna... Oh, okay, you, you crossed the line when you did that, bitch. Fuck you. You not mess with me like that. You climb. Okay, you asked for it. Yeah. Asshole. It's been a 
while since we've actually needed to use this anywhere off, out of right up not on the sea and we got a full moon. <laughs> Is there one over here as well? That's a lot. Yo! How are things in the world, Link? As you can see, I am slowly growing older and feebler. Seems only my wisdom is full of vigor lately. But that is just the way of life, child, and not cause for sadness. If there is anything you wish to know, just ask. I will aid you as I may. What is it you wish to know? Hmm. What do you wish to learn about? Are you concerned about the little Koroks who left the eye? Uh, left the uh, safety of our forest haven. If it is indeed true that there are many islands on the great sea that have grown dark and dangerous, who knows what perils might await my children? I shall mark the places that my Korak children have journeyed to on your sea chart link. Could you be so kind as to check on them for me as you proceed with your quest? I entrust their care to you. Is there anything else you wish to ask? What is it you wish to know? You wish to know about the Koroks who remain here in the Forest Haven? Well, you can find Hollow in that hole over there researching potions. And as for Makar, well, just look, he is right there, Makar. He is busy practicing a new song for next year's ceremony. He is already looking forward to it. Is there anything else you wish to ask? What is it you wish to do? The Forest Water. So you have learned the secret of our Forest Haven. The forest water is a mystical and powerful drug that fills a drug that fills the trees with life and vitality. With such water it would be even possible to return life to a battered with a tree. And yet the forest water is quickly spoiled by the air outside the forest haven. Once it leaves the borders of these forests, it will lose its potential body after just twenty minutes and become no different from ordinary water. And that means in real time. That's why the quest where you gotta uh, put water on like all of the uh, trees that are scattered around, you've got to do that within 20 minutes for all of them. There's quite a number of them. Which is why it's probably impossible at this point in time, but later on it'll be possible. I suppose it is thanks to such water that this gnarled old tree has been able to live for so many long years. Makar, how you doing? I am going to practice much more so that next year's performance will be spectacular. I hope you'll come back to see us again then. You will, won't you? You know what? Let's drink the red potion. So that we can maybe see if we can get anything from there. <laughs> If only I had many of the flower monster seeds from the forbidden woods, then I should make a potion that replenishes both life and magic power for you. Don't you know about them? Well, I've got a few of them. I don't know if I've got enough, but I've got a few. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's that's a book of Papa seed. That's it. That's what I need to make the kind of super replenishing potion that would help you, swordsman. All right, I'm going to use four of your seeds to create a sewer replenishing potion. Please wait just a moment. <laughs> He's got them on the walls, though. He's got plenty. On Calamangela Chuwe! A Chuwe. This is my way. 
<laughs> the way they walk. Ha ha! It's ready. Here you go. We got some blue potions. That is a replenish both life and geomagic power. Keep it in your bottle until you need it. If that's blue, then I imagine the blue choo choos, which are rare, if you bring them to the, the guy on Windfall, he probably makes the same kind of potion, I'd imagine. But this guy has a better deal, because it's easier to come by for the items we need for this. Come see me again after you gather more seeds. I'll be waiting. I wonder if he makes any other type of potions. So. So, otherwise I'm doing this completely wrong and have to do it all over again. And I would hate to have to do that because that would suck. I just gotta figure out where the freaking hell I'm supposed to go. It's not that bit, it's right over there actually. So I need to head north. Law of Major. Incredible, did you just fly down here? That's the coolest thing ever. Hey, if you can fly, do you think maybe you can hit that switch over there, huh? Can you? Maybe. You can't see it? It's just over there, up towards the top of the forest haven. Don't you have a telescope? I mean, who doesn't in this day and age? You have to hit that switch up there if you want to get down into the Nintendo Gallery, nestled there beneath the island. If you had a telescope, you could probably see what I'm talking about. That switch is a real pain. See, once you become a f gallery member, they teach you how to activate the switch, but I'm not a member yet. Dang, if I could only fly through the skies. we like a seagull, that would be great. Hint, hint, hint. Seagulls. Oh, I see it. I don't need the telescope to see that. Ass sees it. It's like... In Skyward Sword, the beetle, it's kind of like that with these seagulls, isn't it? Up we go, seagulls away! Oh god, no, oh, 
Okay, you have to fly to get it up. Ah, just like the beetle, it's pain in the ass controls. Fly! Fly! There we go. Seagull was probably like, what the fuck did you do that for? I was just helping. You make me hit a switch? What the fuck? Imagine if there was like a long way down. Uh, you can return to the skies now. I said you can... I'm pressing R, but it's not doing anything. Yeah. Ah, uh, am I stuck with the seagull? Really? What can I do about this situation? It's not responding to the R button. Can you crash into anything at all? Hit by anything? Okay, there. Like, no, nope, it didn't work. Oh, it's because it's within range. Serious? I can't wander into the danger zone. That's bad. Because I can't exit. God damn you, Seagull! Seagull, leave me be. Okay, I can just press start to get rid of it. Okay, that helps. Pearl is sub figurines in the gallery membership. Quiet, don't you? I don't have a membership, but I'm coming in anyway. Hello, Mr. Doc. Oh, I, you were a member this whole time. Awesome. Hey, I think you I got in and became a member too. Check it out. I gave this guy a pictograph and he gave me this figurine in return. Talk about cool. This will be all the rage. Welcome. Welcome to the Nintendo Gallery Figurine Palace. This is your first time here, isn't it? Did one of your members provide you with an introduction, I hope? Ah, well, no worries one way or the other. We've been losing members due to our lack of gimmicky attractions, but we don't worry. But uh, we don't worry. True fans know we're the coolest. Is this breaking the fourth wall here? Because it is called a Nintendo gallery. Or if anything, like if it's Nintendo, it's like due to our lack of gimmicky attractions, but that's what Nintendo's all about. Or maybe it was just like, maybe that was... Maybe when they made this game... They were thinking like, you know what? Our next console is going to be real gimmicky. That'll get our fan base back. Yeah. And then people were like, what the fuck, Nintendo? Well, Nintendo Wii wasn't that bad, really. I don't know how the Wii U is, but I hear that one flopped more than the, the original Wii did. So anyway, do you know what it takes to become a member of our club? The figurines we have on display here have all been... Made using pictographs provided by our devoted members. If you bring me the master sculptor a pictograph that steals my breath away, then you'll become a member and you'll become able to view the collection in our galleries, and won't that be nice? Do you have such a pictograph? We essentially give him pictographs and he makes, uh, um, essentially, uh, figurines of them. So we got two, I suppose. We could have taken a third one. How about this guy? Oh, well, this is almost right. If only you had taken a shot that showed the subject's entire body. I'd be quite inspired to craft a figurine of this. You gotta have a full body shot, you fucking asshole. Ah, ha, ha, mm, mm, mm. Uh, This is quite an inspiring motive. Oh, ho, 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 oh. So she wasn't kidding about her looks then. <laughs> Ora, I'm filled with inspiration. Please permit me to sculpt this. It will be a jewel of a figurine. But, guy, that wasn't a full body shot. It was mostly a full body shot, but not full. So what's your name, kid? Link. Link, is it? Well, Link, this officially marks your induction into our little club. I think I should be done with this tomorrow. If you'd like, you can go ahead and take a look at our gallery in the meantime. Which is pretty much empty. You should get some figurines made, too. See if we can get a figurine of you, you dork. Let's get a bit further back. Yeah, he's even got a piggy. Oh, 
Oh, no, Link, the figurine-making process is a trade secret. I'm afraid I can't let you take any pictographs of my work. Could you come back tomorrow? Uh, I can't give him... I think it's only, like, one per time. Which is a bit of a pain in the ass. Because then you got a passage of time. Passage. Song of Passage. I hope this doesn't freaking count towards Beatles freaking offers because I'll be pissed off because I'm assuming it's in real time. Are you done? Welcome, Link. The figurine you requested is ready. It's been a long time since I've done work. This is ex ah, exceptional. Go in that door there to check it out. Which door, I don't know. I put it in the second room from the right. My right. Okay. How about this guy? Does he have his own figurine? Are you saying my fans want this figurine? Wow, that golden, freshly brushed hair. That stylish yet unassuming bod. Why, this is a mighty handsome man. And he's standing right there, so he must feel either creeped out or just like, Wow, this is the best compliment I've ever had. Most of my very soul compels me to make a figurine for this picture. Please permit me to sculpt this. It will be a jewel of our figurine. Alrighty. As usual, you have to wait until tomorrow. I bet you're looking forward to seeing what you're going to get. You're going to have your own figurine, man. Hey, oh, hey, wow. What kind of figurine are you after? If you have a picnic box, you can get as many figurines as you like. Yeah, wow, this place is like paradise. Was it in this one? Actually, what's this sign say? View in your favorite figurines, move, uh, zoom, explanation, blah, talk about simple. Doesn't tell me what room this is dedicated to, figurine-wise. Doesn't look like it's the one that's... Ah, oh, I think I went the wrong one, that's why. It's confusing because he said to your right and I went to his left because I wasn't thinking from his perspective. So it would actually be this one. And it's windfall design, so it's obvious. Uh, do we even know the woman's name? There she is. Because these figurines come with all that. Just simple. Info. Minenko, birthplace Windfall Island, favorite things, pictographs. This former beauty became famous after being dubbed Miss Windfall Island about 40 years ago. There is no younger woman who could take that title away. The eyes. Look how many there are though, man. There's just so many. We gotta do like one at a time. Talk about a pain in the ass. Man. I wanna freaking, you know, at least get the freaking uh, stuff done with the plot. But we're 45 minutes. I'm going to do one more recording after this for calling the recording session because it's still, you know, very late. Anyways, I'll see you next time, viewers. See you next time.